Alrighty, hey, what's going on, everybody? We are live, back with some more Final Fantasy VII Remake. You should start your streams like that more. Oh, yeah? Okay, alrighty, eh? <laughs> okay, alrighty, hey, what's going on, guys? Alright, you overdid it. Okay, well, that's what happens. Anyways, we're back. Last episode, a lot of stuff happened. This episode, we're starting off heading back into Wall Market to basically go through it so we can go, we're going to go try to find Marlene, who is hopefully at Aerith's mom's house. But first, we're going to just go in uh, to Wall Market just to check it out and see what we can find in here. Because obviously, I want to go talk to Chadley. Uh, we might fight the fat chocobo. That could be uh, a pretty good idea to do while we're here. Hey there, for a pharmacy. All right, let's see. What do you got to buy? Nothing on sale. He doesn't do sales. All right, so that's that's what's up with this dude. But that's a bad idea. Wait. So this is the first time we're able to be back. I can't even utilize this now. This is the first time we're back in Wall Market, and it still seems like it's nighttime again. I was hoping the next time we'd be back here it would be day, so that we can get these treasure chests in these areas. Or maybe it might be different. Yeah, okay. So we definitely want to. I think there was at least three that we had seen. So here's the first one. A Moogle medal, you know, that's always worth it. I was hoping it wasn't like a high potion because that would be a slap in the face. I forgot my speaker was still on, it scared me. Okay, let's see. What else do we have? I mean, we can go take a peek at the materia shop. Before we continue on, excuse me, move, get the frick out of the way. Okay, what's up, guy? What you doing here at a time like this? I'm trying to check out your materia. That's what the frick I'm doing here. All right, you have nothing I care about. Goodbye. All right, we're gonna go back this way because I don't think we necessarily. I don't know. Let's just pay Madam M and visit. Is she in? Hello? She seems to not be in right now. Or she's in a session. Which, if that's the case, we do not want to be here. Alright, so that's going to be the way that we're going to leave. The first thing we need well, at least to find a place one of the ways field. that we have an opportunity to leave. Let's go this way. Oh! Excuse me, brother. I really need to just get to this. We're searching the compound as we speak, sir. Come on, man. Oh, we can't go that way because of the freaking guards, dude. Oh, hey, is this, uh... Oh, it's your boy. Did you find what you were looking for? Thanks to you, I did. Good. Now never let it go again. Thanks my friend all right i really oh no dude chadley what's with all these soldiers in the streets all of a sudden i'm the trying to get there speaks, no what? he's right there that sucks Found him? wait we're searching maybe the we can go this way we speak, sir. oh nope <laughs> Guards are everywhere. Found them. We're searching the compound as we speak, right. sir. So this isn't really a hey, let's explore this city because half of it's freaking blocked off. So you can get to the general store. You can technically get to the inn. I didn't check to see if you can actually. Wait, what? Oh, it's a jukebox. I didn't see if you could actually like spend the night, but you can get to the general store in the materia shop. That's it. Mm -hmm. And you can leave, which I'm gonna freaking leave. And you can get to Andrea as well. To have a little word with him, but we're leaving. 
That's all we're here for. You guys run into Jesse at the villa? Yeah. Biggs, too. They were both in pretty bad shape. But Wedge wasn't up there with them. He got out. Alright. Yeah, but he, he got out, but, like, he stayed in the freaking plate, dude. And he got crunched. Hey, what's up? Come on now. There's no need to be afraid. We're all scared. Yeah, we are. I've been thinking, y'all. We gotta go find the others. Huh? If we don't look for them, who will? Uh, right. Hey, Cloud. Gonna need your help with it, too. Right. The others? There is no others. Well, we definitely don't want to go this way because that leads us back to Walmart. It's so it's just a straight shot, boys. Thank you for the host. I didn't even know you were gonna do it. I wanted to see the uh, the notification for it, but that's fine. It's all good. I'll see it in the VOD. My ears are still ringing from it. <laughs> yeah. I didn't even this think of it. Five, right? So where's this place you said Marlene is? Where I think she is. It's a house on the other side of town. Well, come on then. Pick up the pace. Huh? I'm going as fast as you are. So... Whoa. Is this guy still selling? Did a plate really fall? Yeah, dude. It really fell. You can buy the co the gothic bangle now. Magician's brace. Oh, this is new. This is new. Oh, baby. Oh, my God. Alright, so we're definitely looking at this stuff. So this sorcerer's one would be pretty good. So she's at 63 right now. That would bring her down by 20, but it would raise her magic. So that might be good for after. But this heavy duty bracer. This would definitely be good. If I could get three of them. We need just under 15,000. Let's see. The wrist guards. Okay. So that'll be a good purchase, I think. You know what? Whatever. Just run it. Like, we need it. The Magician's Bracelet. Like, that is great. The unfortunate thing is there's no combined slots, but that's fine. Um... Wait, this isn't even good. This is actually trash, bro. Yeah, materia slots. Who the frick cares, dude? So this might be good for Aerith, but honestly, for these three, we're gonna get three of these. We need 350 more gills. You know what? Time to sell some rando crap. These high potions? Don't need them. We'll sell eight of them to get extra juice. Alrighty. Maybe... I don't know if Chadley will be here. We could always... hope. Alright. Let's go ahead and equip these. World's just too dangerous. Brother, I don't... It's these days not to keep a weapon I don't want to hear you talking to me anymore. I'm done with you. Two slots. That's what we got so far, so... It'll be nice... They are combined, but I don't think anyone's using them as a combination piece. Okay. We will re-slot. Did we get them? Yeah, okay. And then Barrett. Give him a heavy-duty bracer. Tifa. Heavy-duty bracer. 
now, let's see what we can get. We can give everyone one more piece of materia. This is pretty hype. Does anybody actually have lightning right now? Yes, bear does. Okay. Let's see. Binding material? That's a waste, I think. I was thinking maybe I'll take steel or honestly I think I might yeah I might take assess back yeah I think I'll take assess back okay so then for Barrett we can give him two now at this point we could probably, let's give him an HP up. He can level that up, and then we'll give him, what magic does he have? He just has, he, oh, he has uh, lightning and wind. Hmm. We can give him, uh, I don't know, man. I do not know. I just, I don't want to give people just freaking materia just to give them materia, you know? They're not going to use it. And he does have auto cure already. Honestly, dude, give him... We're going to take the chakra from Tifa. Because that'll be a good, like, kind of like... What is this healing? And then we'll give her what magic? Healing, ice, revival. Okay, we'll give her another attack. I think with ice, we'll give her. Give her the poison again, and then. Warding. prayer takes two slots so honestly like ah uh, well you know what run it okay cool after we did all that I was gonna save I think that'll work Oh, yeah. Get a plate, really? Let's get our money back. I mean, not totally, but these studded bracers we do not need anymore. Mithril armlet. She's using gothic, so I don't think we need to like keep old stuff. These we can definitely get rid of. Alright. Cast back well, to 8,000. Alright. What do we got here? Does not look like Chadley's here. But that's okay. What is this? Oh, the, the Moogle shot. Let's see. What about the general? Yeah, yeah, you don't do discounts. As if life wasn't hard enough. What do you got? Nothing interesting. Later. There is a bench here that Oh Chadley is here. Hell yeah, dude. Cloud. I'm glad to see that you're okay. In these trying times, I hope to develop huh? new materia to help us endure. Oh, he is here, brother. He is, dude. Yo, what did you make for me? ATB stagger. Small ATB boost on staggering foe. 
cool beans. I will buy it. Um, and then I think we should fight the fat chocobo. Then I invite you to ready your I think with simulator. three peeps, we can run it, dude. And we're just pretending that, like... Oh, we don't have something important going on. Let's just play a game in VR. Oh my god, he's huge! He's a big boy! Alright, who's still... I do have assess. Ow. Allow me. Let's see. Fat Chocobo. A, pl a pleasingly plump summon recreated in virtual reality. It is the manifestation of the legendary Chocobo. A symbol of fertility and good fortune. Fat chocobos appear in many a beloved fairy tale. We do not know what he is weak to, but he's got resistance to physical, greater resistance to fixed damage and proportional damage. Not entirely sure what those all mean, but... Back up! Oh, Alright, that shouldn't have hit me. Fingers crossed, Koopo. What is this? Um, excuse me, brother? Alright, let's hit him with a... What the? Wow, dude. Okay, um... Barret. Wait, we're gonna pause for a second? Uh, he cannot have anything stolen from him, so... We'll just have him... Do a focus shot and Tifa. I think we can have him get in with the star shower. Oh baby, that was some good damage. Warp, warp, warp. What is he doing? Please stop, brother. Don't do it. Stop. He's a freaking pinball, dude. Stop. Barret. Actually, raise your defense. That'd be nice. What do you What do you spawn? Tifa. Um. You can hit Cloud with the Cura. That'd be. What the freak are you, brother? Ooh. We'll hit him with an Infinity's End. No, don't move, don't move. Oh, good, I got it. It's, it's, it was the same. Oh, oh, auto care. Ow. What did you throw at me? Alright, I wonder who summon is gonna get used. Alright, let's see. Out again, need some juice. Wow, dude. Alright, let's see. No. You are going to use a Mega Potion on Tifa. And I am going to see if... Could be anybody, but I think, honestly, a free is the best choice. Do your thing. My boy. Crimson die. Smacked him up. Please, dude. The move needs to back the freak up. Honestly, uh, let's see. Tifa. It's the smartest for her to heal. I'm gonna try to get a double. I don't know what that was. Um, nope, 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 nope. Radiant plume on the fat choke bow. Oh, hoo -hoo. 
Oh, bear. Uh, raise your defense someone? Oh, I knew he was going to hit me. If free. <laughs> It's reduced, dude. Uh, hit him with the Crimson Dive, brother. Um, Tifa. <laughs> oh my god, dude. What's happening? I got lim my limit break, by the way. Ooh, yeah. Hellfire. Come on, how much damage are you doing on this boy? Huh? Oh, staggered. Hit him with the, hit him with the limit break. The little bit of cross flash. While he's... Oh my god, the damage, dude! Him with an infinity's end before it's over. It's over. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, okay, Tifa, can you hurry up and hit him before he's done being staggered? She's gone in. He's gone. Barret, finish him off with a focus shot. We'll finish him with a freaking braver, dude. We he, we done it, dude. Nothing to it. Easy. Didn't even die once. Truly amazing work, Cloud. Thanks, Chadley. This is incontrovertible proof that the universe has a sense of humor. Now that you have a fun new partner in Fat Chocobo, you can work together to squash Shinra like a bug. You bet. Ooh. I've done it. Enemy skill, dude! Wait, what? Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Cloud, I have come up with the most fascinating theory. Oh. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? I will definitely do that. I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information for my research. Just forget, you don't have to buy to all of your the summon battle intel submissions. Uh, things. Okay, let's see. What else did he give me? Monster variants two. So we have to defeat uh, ten unique varieties of monsters. We already got six out of ten on that one. We have to assess thirty enemy types. Since I've assessed like sixty. We already got we get the enemy skill so that's what i completed even though i already freaking i just started it i still haven't gotten this one i just got confused or i'm still confused with it but honestly i think barrett because the cactuar one is absolutely like trash we're going to give barrett the fat chocobo freaking summon Ultimate attack, Kerplunk. The greatest. Alright, so we're gonna take Assess off and give him enemy skill. Because most likely he's gonna be hit with the most um, attacks. And we can learn that stuff. So I think now. Hmm, honestly. We're gonna give Tifa the assess because I really don't care about poison. So, okay, cool. What do we? No, yeah, I wanted Cloud to have yeah, 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 enemy skill, enemy skill. Cool. Well, that was easy enough. Let me check out the materials. Did you hear about what happened shop quick. None that we don't have. Okay. Materia is what you want when shit hits the fan. But yeah, I think. Oh wait, 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 wait. Before we 
actually go to Aerith's house. We have to go see my favorite Moogle. Wait a minute. Never mind. The kid's freaking place is locked up right now. That's bogus. I wanted to go spend more of my my Moogle uh, medals. Speaking of, I know I've gotten a lot lately. I'm at 22. Might have been nice. But after defeating the big boy, Fat Chocobo, I'm going to pop a quick save before we head on to Aerith's mom's house. Alrighty. Roll out. Oh yeah, is Miss Folia here? Or is she still at freaking Walmart? What are you doing, dude? I mean, I sure hope Marlene's here. Marlene's supposed to be here, but you never know what they uh, what they decide to change up. Marlene, Marlene! Let's see. Where's Marlene? Is she here? Baron. <laughs> Marlene's my little girl. Marlene, she's got short hair. She's cute as a button, with the heart of an angel. She was wearing, uh, pink. She was wearing a she's pink dress today. She's sleeping upstairs. Huh? Oh. I said she's sleeping. Uh, I want to see her too. Come on, let's go look in on her. Keep it down. Don't wake her. Okay, okay. Maybe you should join your friend upstairs. Let's go say hi. Yep, she's there. She's okay. Marlene, my baby. Thank God. Shinra has my daughter now. I'm sorry. No, I'm the one who asked her to go get Marlene. We'd only just met, but she was so kind and helpful. I took advantage of her. It's not your fault. It was only a matter of time before she ended up back there. Because she's an ancient. Is that it? So she told you about that. She must trust you all a great deal. Yes, Aerith is an ancient. Probably the last one living. She's not my daughter. Not by blood, I mean. If that's what you were wondering. About 15 years ago. My husband, he'd been shipped off to fight on the front lines. But then I received a letter saying he'd be home for a bit. So when the day came, I went to the station to meet him. He didn't come. I couldn't help fearing the worst, even then. But I told myself his leave must have been postponed, that he'd been delayed. 
Every day I went to wait and to pray. And that's how I met her, her and her mother. I thought maybe they'd run away from Wall Market, or that they were topsiders fallen on hard times. I'd seen that sort of thing a lot. Take Aerith somewhere safe. Those were her mother's dying words. My husband had been away for so long, and I was lonely. So I convinced myself the safest place for the girl was with me. It took no time at all for her to start feeling like family. She was a real chatterbox. She told me strange stories. Like how she and her mother had escaped from some sort of facility. And how she wasn't sad because her mother had just returned to their planet. Their planet, huh? Yeah, that sounds about right. I didn't understand any of it at the time. When I asked if she meant one in the sky, she said no. This one, right here. I mean... What can you say to that? Mommy, don't be sad. That's what she said to me one day, out of the blue. So I asked her, what's wrong? A man you really, really loved just died. His heart came a long way to say goodbye. But he couldn't stay because he had to return to the planet. I didn't believe her, of course. And then, a few days later, I received a letter saying my husband had been killed in action. Things like that, she'd just know. It was a lot to deal with, but we were happy. <laughs> and then came the knock. Coming! It sang. No, sung. That's how you say it, right? He's the same age, dude. This guy's like oh, a freaking elf. Go away. You know you're not just any little girl. You're a descendant of the ancients. I had no idea what he meant, so I said, who are the ancients? They were the original stewards of the planet, whose boundless knowledge and wisdom shall guide us to the promised land. Some believe the promised land to be a myth, others an allegory of sorts. But we take the words of the scriptures at face value and believe it to be quite real. Which is why Shinra would like very much for Aerith to help You're us- You're wrong! I'm not an ancient! <sighs> but Aerith, even when you're all alone, don't you hear voices whispering secrets? No, never! <clears throat> but all three of us knew that wasn't true. That man knew exactly who Aerith was, where she'd come from, and what she could do. They knew where she was, but they didn't just take her? Doesn't sound like the Turks I know. She had to come willingly, otherwise it wouldn't work, they said. That's why, even if they did take her away, I'm sure she's still being treated like a guest. And that they'll send her straight back home. Once they get what they need. I doubt it. You're not planning anything, are you? Don't make things worse than they already are. If I lost her too, 
I don't know if I could, if I could ever. Just don't. Cloud, maybe she's right about this. Maybe they'll let Aerith go when it's all over. Maybe we'd be better off waiting a little while. Let's head back to Sector 7. Got things to take care of. Like checking up on the bar. Yeah. Okay. Crunchy. Okay. So that means going back to the Sector 7th 